week we're thinking about how we connect with God and different ways we can do that. And today I want to connect with God through silence and solitude. And that's just time alone in the quiet with God and us. And I know that can be tricky for some of us um, in our life circumstances and the stage of life we're at to find a quiet place. Um, but I want to encourage you to, to try this, to take 10 minutes, maybe if you've never done it before, uh, longer if you can, but it may be first thing in the morning, just to take 10 minutes to find a quiet place with a lack of external noise, a lack of input, a lack of stimulus, so that we can find a quiet place within our hearts with God. And you might find it helpful to, to have a candle, some people find that helpful, or your Bible, just handy, uh, to have a psalm or a poem just to focus your mind. And I want to start us this morning with Psalm 46, verse 10, where it says, Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. In other versions, it might say, cease striving. Cease striving. And it's just that moment to stop. And to let go of the distractions and the worries and the fear and the anxiety that fills our minds and to focus on God and know that he is God as we cut out the other noise that we hear the whisper of God and it can be uncomfortable for us it's not maybe common in our cultural tradition to, to be still and be quiet and be silent and on our own but battle through that and you might just find that in as you as you sit in the quiet and maybe those emotions rise and just see God cover them by his spirit. I know I've gone into times of solitude before, maybe agitated or angry at something or someone and just spending that time alone with God in the quiet changes me, changes something. And I come out full of compassion. I think it's Henry Nguyen who said, compassion is the fruit of solitude. And we see that with Jesus' life, he would go back and forth between spending time in silence and solitude and going to be with the others and in the community. And so I want to encourage us today to, to take 10 minutes to be still and know that he is God. Be still and know that he is God. Father, we want to know you better. We want to know you more deeply. We want to know your spirit deep within us and so father i pray that whatever our circumstances whatever our our situation we might be able to find those few moments to sit in the quiet with you to hear your still small voice your whisper in us and over us that we might connect with you better and therefore connect with others better in Jesus' name, amen. I just want to encourage you, the great thing about this is you can't do this well or badly. There is, there's just showing up. And so I want to encourage you to just show up today. Just take those 10 minutes and that's the success. And so why don't you join us this evening, 8 p.m. for our Facebook Live worship session and have a great day.